for today's force Friday, I wanted to show how important it is to use all of the different forces throughout the swing and, and specifically how important horizontal force is in the front leg. So if we watch this hitter and we scroll forward, we can see at the end that he over rotates a little bit. We can see how he gets to the outside of both feet. We can see the number on the back of his jersey from the face on right camera. But the one thing we don't really pick up on is how much drift this player has. So using the Swing Catalyst software, we can do a little top down view and we can see that when this player gets to heel plant, it's about right there, we can kind of draw a line here at the back of his hip. And then we can progress him forward throughout the swing. And we can see right as he's starting to rotate, we see that how much he's drifted there and how much he's kind of uh, lost space going forward, but also gained ground and sped up the pitch by coming forward as well uh, after heel touch or heel plant. So uh, the one thing we want to see, especially when we're looking over here at force, is we want to see these forces either, uh, we want to see them go all about the same time or in sequential order of what the player is trying to do. So if we watch here, we can see how uh, vertical and torque are about to go up. So we see them starting to go up, whereas horizontal still hasn't made that move against the pitcher or away from the pitcher. So we can see how these are starting to creep up. And then now as we're starting to use that horizontal force, we're already halfway through both of our other force uh, production uh, parts of the swing. So this is going to create this player to really fly forward and over rotate because he doesn't have anything resisting that motion going forward until a little too late. So with a little cueing and kind of helping with some setup, what we can do is we'll watch this here on face on right. But when we look at the top down, we can see now how as this player gets to heel touch, we can see how we're at right there and as he's swinging how he maintains a good axis that front hip now replaces the back hip and we reduce the amount of rotation and we help this player get through the pitch much much better and if we look here at force we can see how each of these forces start to go up and they start to interact all at the same time. So if we watch this again, we can see how this horizontal force starts to push away from the pitcher, the vertical force starts to push up, and that torque starts to uh, vault that rotation going forward. So we can see how they're all in unison, allowing him to efficiently push all that energy up into his body, into rotation, out through the hands, into the back. So that's one way that we can use horizontal force in the front leg to help with our direction and maybe keep us from drifting or losing quite so much space.